Today is Megan's first day trying Exhance. Glad you're here for it. You see that? You blow instead of sniff. That's easy enough, right? Let's take a closer look at how to use Exhance. A mouthpiece? Well, that's different, and for good reason. Nasal polyps originate on inflamed tissue, high and deep in the nasal passages where sinuses drain. It can be hard to get medication that high and that deep. Exhance is a different kind of nasal spray. You blow and don't sniff. With Exhance, your breath helps deliver medicine high and deep into your nasal passages to areas of inflamed tissues where nasal polyps originate and sinuses drain. This may give you the relief you're seeking. Getting Exhance ready is easy. Before you use a new Exhance for the first time, you have to prime it. First, remove the cap. Then, give the device a good shake. There you go. Next, pump the bottle seven times or until you see a fine mist. Ah, oh, look at that mist. Uh, yeah, you can stop now. After priming Exhance for the first time, you do not need to prime it again. If, however, you have not used Exhance for seven or more days, reprime Exhance by spraying two times. Now, let's see how to use Exhance. It is important to remember to shake Exhance before each use. Also, ensure you have the correct grip. Using one or two hands, place your fingers on the indented grip below the flexible mouthpiece. Oh, no, 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 where's that finger going? You want to keep it below the mouthpiece. There you go. Now you're ready. Step one, seal. Gently insert the nose piece as far into your nose as is comfortable and the flexible mouthpiece into your mouth. Don't worry, it's okay to bend the flexible mouthpiece. It's important to make sure you get a good seal between the nose piece and your nostril. Step two, aim. Aim the device upward between your eyes, which will help the medicine go high and deep into your nose. It may help to use a mirror for the first couple of times. A little more to the left, not quite that much. Ah, oh, now, that's the spot right there. Well done. Step three, blow. Take a deep breath and then blow hard into the mouthpiece as if you are blowing up a balloon. You will feel resistance until you press the bottle. Step four, press. And now, while still blowing, press the bottle with your thumb. This will release the medicine. Exhance is designed to deliver medicine high and deep into your nasal passages to the inflamed areas where nasal polyps originate. By blowing into Exhance, it closes your soft palate and helps prevent the medicine from going down your throat. That's part of what makes the exhalation delivery of Exhance so different. Make sure to keep blowing when you press the bottle to help make the medicine go high and deep into your nose. Do not try to sniff or block the other nostril. That's a no-no. If you have a good seal and aim between the eyes, the air should go out the opposite nostril when you blow and press. Now, repeat these steps for your other nostril. Remember to use Exhance twice daily. Let's bring it all together, shall we? Seal, aim, blow, press. It's that simple. Want more step-by-step -step details? Review the full instructions for use. Just like Megan, more and more patients are discovering Exhance and experiencing a medicine that goes high and deep into the nasal passages. Now it's your turn. Important safety information. Do not use Exhance if you are allergic to fluticasone propionate or any of the ingredients in Exhance. Get emergency medical care if you get any of these signs of a serious allergic reaction. Rash, hives, swelling of your face, mouth, and tongue, breathing problems, or low blood pressure. Tell your healthcare provider about all your medical conditions and medications that you take. It is especially important to mention if you take antifungal or anti-HIV medicines as they may interact with Exhance. Exhance can cause nasal problems such as nosebleeds, crusting, sores, hole in the septum, and slow wound healing. Exhance can cause eye problems including glaucoma and cataracts. You should have regular eye exams when using Exhance. Exhance may increase the risk of infections and can make certain infections worse. Avoid contact with people who have a contagious disease such as chickenpox or measles while using Exhance. Exhance can cause reduced production of steroid hormones by your adrenal gland, resulting in tiredness, weakness, nausea and vomiting, and low blood pressure. Exhance can weaken bones, osteoporosis. Other side effects may include redness, pain or swelling of the nose or throat, thrush, fungal infection of the nose and throat, nasal congestion, sinus infection, and headache. These are not all the side effects of Exhance. 
Call your doctor for medical advice about side effects. You may report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088. Before using Exhance, carefully read the FDA-approved patient information and instructions for use.